When you hear the word diva, perhaps you think of Aretha Franklin, Diana Ross. Well, now think about this. A group of local women is giving divas brand new meaning. Fox 5's Dyrell Joyner shows us some ladies who are blazing one serious trail. Deb Troll is a photographer for Innover Fairfax Hospital. And Anne Marie Vaskell, a web page designer for a company called Caliber in Fairfax County as well. Women who love to work, but also women who love to. Hit somebody, lady! Which is why first year player Anne Marie took up a dare to be on the DC Divas. My nickname is Smiley because when I hit someone, I continue to smile. <laughs> Now second year player, quarterback Deb Troll, led the Divas to a three and four record last season, but believes a year of getting adjusted to getting hit and playing in pads will help them tremendously this season. Learned a lot how to deal with the pressure, the pressure of, of learning the playbook inside and out and, and trying to learn, learn how to read the defense, all aspects of football you, I never really got a taste of uh, playing with flag. Now the Divas practice three times a week, three to four hours a day. And that's not counting game days on Saturday. And get this, they're not even getting paid. You're definitely playing for the love of the game and for the hope that in the future the girls will, will get to that point where they'll get the paycheck. I know we don't get, you know, we, we don't make a million dollars or... Um, but just the opportunity is there for women. So as Deb Troll continues her successful career as a photographer in Nova Fairfax Hospital, she also continues to be a successful quarterback in the NWFL. She hopes the league will not be a quick snapshot. Instead, it will take some time to develop into a league like the WNBA. Reporting from in Nova Fairfax Hospital, I'm Daryl Joyner for Fox 5 News at 10. Kind of digging the divas there. <laughs> I think that would be better than the XFL, which is yeah. obviously a bomb. Yeah, it was. It would. Watch the ladies out there. I bet we could have some male cheerleaders, too. I mean, get the whole packet. It's like powder puff back in high school. Yeah, it looked a little days. tougher than that to me. Yeah, you're right. Their first yeah. game's coming up on April 20th, too. Oh, so. I wish them the best. Yeah. Absolutely. That is great. Well, we